let's review cranial nerves and foramina in the skull. Notice the color code for the types of cranial nerves. Blue for sensory, orange for motor, and green for mixed. In this diagram, the cranial nerves are put in order. Cranial nerve number one. olfactory. Cranial nerve number two, optic. Number three, oculomotor. Number four, trochlear. Number five, trigeminal. Number six, abducens. Number seven, Facial, number eight. Vestibulocochlear, number nine. Glossopharyngeal, number ten. Vagus, number eleven. Accessory, number twelve. Hypoglossal. Now note that Cranial nerve 3 and 4 emerge from the midbrain. Cranial nerves 5, 6, 7, and 8 emerge from the pons. Cranial nerves 9, 10, and 12 emerge from the medulla oblongata. Okay, now let's name the cranial nerves, not necessarily in order. And we'll start with the green box on the top right and go clockwise around the diagram. The first pictured is optic nerve. The next, trigeminal. The green, facial, the yellow, glossopharyngeal, the orange, vagus, the blue, accessory, the yellow, hypoglossal, the pink, vestibulocochlear, the purple, abducens, the pink, trochlear, the lighter yellow, oculomotor, and the final, olfactory. Now let's look at the foramina. This figure shows a superior view of the skull base, showing foramina and which cranial nerves pass through them. We'll start at the top and work our way down. The first foramen is the cribriform plate through which the olfactory nerve passes. The second is the optic canal through which the optic nerve passes. The third is the superior orbital fissure through which the oculomotor nerve, trochlear nerve, ophthalmic nerve, and abducens nerve all pass. Note that the ophthalmic nerve is the first branch of the trigeminal nerve.
The following foramen is the foramen rotundum, through which the maxillary nerve passes, the second branch of the trigeminal nerve. The next foramen is foramen ovale, through which the mandibular nerve, the third branch of the trigeminal nerve, passes. Next, the internal acoustic meatus, through which the facial nerve and the vestibulocochlear nerve pass. Then we have a jugular foramen. Through which the glossopharyngeal, vagus, and accessory nerve pass. And the final foramen, the hypoglossal canal, through which the hypoglossal nerve passes.